And hello from the Strobel Allee. We find ourselves at the Signal Iduna Park. It's Borussia Dortmund against Bayern, a game of real residence here in Germany. Derek Ray here on the commentary gantry, and I'm joined by Stuart Robson. Stuart, what are you expecting today? Well, I'm expecting a really close game today. This is a rivalry that's been really good in recent times. Yes, Bayern have dominated, but on their day, Dortmund can outplay anybody, particularly in this wonderful arena. starts alongside Manuel Akanji in central defence and it's two strikers up front who will look to provide the goal scoring threat well here is the Bayern side Manuel Neuer stands between the posts Dayo Upamecano plays alongside Lucas Hernandez in central defence Kingsley Coman starts with Leroy Zane in the wide areas and leading the line today Robert Lewandowski <laughs> this should be very enjoyable it's Bayern who get things going Müller and Upamecano Thomas Müller really getting stuck in and slipped through beautifully well the flag was up in good time bringing that move to an end well he's just got to be more patient there he's gone too early Magnificently. Well, if he gets this wrong, a penalty and a sending off, but he was spot on with his challenge. Lewandowski and Kimmich. Sané. No high quality defending. Something to worry about here. Goretzka. Sané, Lewandowski, well that is how to nullify the opposition, and the keeper has possession of it. Weiss, now with Bellingham. Good work from Bayern to make sure possession changed hands. Great vision from Leroy Sané, and diving to thwart him. to a Kimmich with the corner not fantastic defending let's see if it helps the opposition and a time for calm on the ball he's in with a chance and a goal to open the scoring no wonder they're celebrating well as you can see the weight of the through ball is key to this goal and there's certainly no doubt about the finish he really hits it with power and accuracy nothing the keeper can do about that a 
And the game back in business, and Bayern have nudged in front. Minier. Manuel Akanji. Marco Reus. Not disappointing for Dortmund to give it away like that. Leroy Zane. A real opening now. Well, really stout defending there. Off the line. Not up a cul-de-sac in terms of the attack. Error from the keeper. Will they seize on it? Well, they really were dicing with a lot of danger. Well, he's made up for his mistake, but he got lucky there, that's for sure. Royce. And he read it well defensively. with authority close Pavard. So nearly at half time, not quite, but Borussia Dortmund finding themselves behind, albeit narrowly. Stuart, how would you sum up what you've seen from them in this game so far? Well, it's been a tight first half so far, but they haven't quite shown enough guile in the attacking third. If, however, they can be more dynamic in the 1v1 situations, they have the quality to turn this around. An encouraging move from Dortmund. And credit is due for that good piece of defending. Well, the conditions look pretty good for the counter-attack. So one minute of stoppage time, that's what the officials have said. And with that, the first half draws to a close. And a more than decent first half showing from Leon Goretzka. What did you make of his performance? Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Into the second half then, with Borussia Dortmund trailing, can they summon the right response? Reina. Daniel Malen. Guerrero. And a fine cross. Well clattered away. Bodies forward and the break looks on. All hands on deck. And they need to get tighter here. And a goal here for Bayern. It's going to be so difficult to thwart them now. Well, here it is again, and it's all about the pace on the counter-attack. They were so quick to break out from their defensive positions, and from there, he never looked like missing. That's a lovely goal. And Bayern will change personnel now. So 2-0 now. Dahoud. A chance for him to get in behind, maybe. And taking it away. Well, Bayern have controlled the majority of possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now. Good pull one back here. 
And the verdict of the officials is offside. Well, he just gets caught ball watching here. Needs to be more alive. Work harder to keep onside and be ready for the chance. So half an hour remaining. He's in behind. Hummels always in charge of the situation after the cross. Opportunity here. Couldn't grab hold of it. Pressing high to win the ball. And the keeper put to the test, but he comes through it. Well, he's so sharp, isn't he? Great first save and then the recovery. Dahoud putting his body on the line. Guerrero, but he dealt with that ball played in rather well. Kimmich, Müller. Now can they counter clinically? Lewandowski, it might be, and he's made it a brace for himself. The defender is just unable to stay with him, and he's having a field day. Here it is again, and it's a superb way to throw the ball to break that defensive line. And there's certainly no doubt about the finish. He really hits it with power and accuracy. Nothing the keeper can do about that. Is this going to be a thrashing? 3 0 now. Emre Can. They've regained possession. Thomas Müller. Schuppermotting. And the keeper caught there. Well, both teams have had substitutes swarming up. And now both will rely on their respective benches. Trying to pick out a teammate. Oh, no end product. Goretzka, body on the line. And breaking at pace with Menace. Doniel Malin. And given away by Dortmund. Thomas Müller. Well, not far away from full time. And it hasn't been Dortmund's day. I think that would be a reasonable assessment, Stuart. Well, this is certainly a performance to forget because they've been totally outplayed today. How many times have they been? Now, hold on, Stuart. They're in here. Well, they pulled one back, but perhaps a bit too late in this contest. They haven't been at the races this evening. Well, let's look at this again, Derek, because the transition when the ball changes hands is so quick and his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Substitution it is for Dortmund. So on with the action and 3 1 the scoreline at the moment. Well, by playing keep ball like this, they're keeping the opposition at bay. And we are going to have two additional minutes. Supermoting. It's with Kingsley Coman. Coman. Kingsley Coman. And a goal to put the final stamp on it. That will do it.
Borussia Dortmund have to accept defeat. What did you think of their performance as a whole? Well, Derek, that just wasn't good enough today. A lack of a game plan, too many players below par, and not enough energy all around the pitch. A really worrying performance for me. Well, it was a terrific performance from Robert Lewandowski. And let's face it, we've said that quite a lot in the past. We're probably going to say it in the future as well. Sensational. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And, of course, he scored two really good goals.